Pura. Pura. Vors. Vors. Roll. Roll. Now say it. Pura vors roll. Yeah. Welcome back to my channel. So I've actually I've actually shortened the hi guys. I don't know if you guys noticed, but like I shortened it so it's not too much. Anyway, welcome back to my channel, guys. If you haven't subscribed yet, then make sure that you click the subscribe button below and join the revolution. I don't think Angie is a strange face for you guys. Like if you watched, I did a prank on her and I told her that I was leaving America suddenly and never coming back, which is funny, right? You know what's funny? The opposite of that has just happened. I can't leave America <laughs> that's the irony the irony karma <laughs> that's what happens when you make me cry man anyway so the irony is that the opposite of that is happening um because of coronavirus I can't go back to South Africa unfortunately guys I was supposed to catch a flight on Monday Monday I was supposed to be getting out here but it's not happening. So the reason why Angie's here today is because we're gonna be making a video comparing American words and South African words. So basically, she obviously is American and I'm South African, and I'm gonna be giving out some words, some South, some common South African words that you use without even thinking about it. It just comes natural. Just when you're speaking, it just comes out. Do you, you get what I'm saying? Give me a five. And she's gonna try guess what it is. The rules of the game are you have three guesses to try and guess what the word is. All right? Cool. The first word is robot. Robot? Yeah. Right. You know, and it's just like the regular robot. <laughs> you know, like. <laughs> That's not what a robot is. Okay, do you want a sentence? Yeah. Okay. When, when cars are driving, right? Mm -hmm. They, um, down. Uh oh, down. Hell oh! The road as cars are driving, there's robots there. That's how, like that's what tells them how to move. You mean like the little like traffic light? <laughs> the traffic light is a robot. Yep. <laughs> Honestly, truly, guys, when I came here, I was so surprised this wasn't a norm. Did you see yourself using that, like, in, your, in a sentence in life? No. No? Is that too weird? It's too drastically different. That makes sense to me, though. Like, after robot, you know, you stop at a robot, then you turn left. And <laughs> the robot turn red. <laughs> yeah, the robot turns red, so you stop. And when the robot is green, you go. <laughs> so the next word is a Russian. What is a Russian? <laughs> Actual Russian. <laughs> Can I get it in a sentence? Okay. Um, I want to eat a Russian today. Oh my God! <laughs> it's food. Yeah, it's food. What kind of food? Oh. It's a Russian. I don't know. That's that almost sounds like cannibalism. What does a Russian sound like? If if I say to you. Mm. Today I'm gonna eat a Russian. Uh, <laughs> what does it know. sound like I'm gonna eat? It sounds like this, like a little type of fast food, like meat. So what do you think a Russian is? Like what type of food? Meat. Meat? Okay, you're right. You're right. Meat, a. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I love meat. Meatballs? No. <laughs> you have one more guess. Do you want another hint? Mm-hmm. So a Russian is, Russians are long. Russians tend to be long and thick. And I, oh! is a sausage oh no and so the reason why I realized that the world is not just calling it a Russian is because I went to Walmart one time to go grocery shopping and I wanted a Russian oh and I was like to the guy listen um, can you please tell me where the Russians are and he looked at me like are you looking for a, a Russian pr we don't 
We don't have anyone Russian. No, I'm not looking for a Russian man or person. I want a Russian, like to eat the food. And he looked at me like, what kind of shit is that? And I actually had to Google it to try to find out what the English word is, which actually had me dumbfounded because Russian is an English word, you know what I mean? So it turns out that the full name for it, it is a Russian, but it's a Russian, I think it's a Russian polbaka or kolbaka or something. That's the full name of the sausage and that's what people know it as. But in South Africa, when you say Russian, how about a Russian? Love a Russian. We know what a Russian is. I <laughs> ever heard anybody said, tell me that word <laughs> in my life. Hey, you want some English sausage or some spicy, like cheesy sausage? Alright. <laughs> and if you don't know, now you know. Next word is vors. One vors. Is it like boss water? Like. <laughs> <laughs> some people eat vors as a snack, other people eat vors as a meal. But oxalayo, we eat vors. Mm. Oxalayo means either way. Dang. Is it a snack? Like those type of snacks that you can find at a party, like you can eat at any time, like a little cheese. That's, it's thick, it's juicy, it's food. You can eat it in a hot dog. You can put it into a hot dog and make a hot dog. Also. Cheese? Vors <laughs> is not cheese, Vors is a sausage. Never leave my house, but I still get sausage. Sausage! sausage. So if that's what Vors is, can you guess what a Buddha Vors roll is? Can you say that? Buddha Vors roll. Can you say it? Burra? Burra. Vors. Vors. Roll. Roll. Now say it. Burra Vors Roll. Yes. <laughs> yes, you're right. So hot dog. With. Sausage. What kind? Spicy. Bruh. So, Vors is a sausage, right? Uh -huh. And a Burra Vors Roll is like a hot dog, yeah? Yeah. So what do you think a Burra Vors Roll is? If burra, burra, vors, roll. See the word vors is in there? Burra vors roll. What do you think that is? A chili hot dog? Like, it's like a hot dog with what in it? Cheese. What else? Meat. Vors, bruh. <laughs> burra vors roll is a roll with. You mean it's like, a hot dog with vors wait, in it? Wait, you mean like pigs in a blanket? A hot dog. <laughs> it's a hot dog. I said hot dog. With vors in it. You're supposed to say it's got vors in it. Vors is sausage, remember? What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this next one is something that I miss so, so, so much. Oh, guys. Wow. Bill Tong. Bill Tong. Biltong. What is biltong? Is it like a tongue? <coughs> no. He's in a sense. I don't even know. Um, when you, I go to the butchery to buy biltong. Meat? It is a type of meat, but what? What kind of meat? Like, Cow? what's done to the meat? Beef? To, no. Clean? Clean meat. Special kind of meat. Fish? Like it's not wet. It's not wet. I don't know if that helps. Rotisserie? It's, not it's like the, like a chicken, but like fried. No. Oh. So, so biltong is dried meat. It's beef jerky. There we go. That's what biltong is. Beef. By the way, guys, if you haven't watched my video, I actually made a video where I tried American beef jerky. So check it out. So the next one is babalas. Babalas. Babalas or babelas. Is it like a candle? No. <coughs> Alright, use it in a sentence. So guys, last night it was nice, it was lit. Um, Mans went a little overboard, now I've got babalas. Hickeys? <laughs> <coughs> Vodka, Hennessy, all that stuff was, you know, slapping last night. Now I've got babalas. Oh, hangover. Yep. Oh. <laughs> oh. <Yeah. laughs> you said hickey. Why were you so shocked about it? Like, <laughs> like imagine your man comes home and you're like, is that a babalas on you? <laughs> I 
<laughs> Next one is a trolley. This one surprised me as well because I feel like it's just normal, it's a vibes. Trolleys, you know, it's a trolley. I mean, we have actual trolleys, but I don't think they're the same thing. It's like a little trolley, it's like a little a train bus thing that they have, like in, in Chicago and stuff like that. That, like, you know, it goes around. It's like a train, yeah. it's like for sightseeing and stuff. I mean, that is an actual trolley, but that's not a trolley in this case. See, guys, see, see, we, when we say trolley, we're not even thinking about bus things, guys. We're not thinking about that. But, um, you want a hint? Yeah. When you're getting a lot of stuff and you have too much to, to hold, use a trolley. Oh my gosh, a cart? Yeah. Uh, is that another thing you said? A carriage, a trolley, what? We don't call it a carriage. What? Nobody calls no, it a carriage. Like, people from London call it a carriage. A trolley? I've never heard that. And they say we don't call it a carriage. But yeah, it's a trolley. Nah, it's a, it's a freaking shopping cart, bro. It's a trolley. It's a, it's a cart. It, but it's a trolley. It, it's a cart. But the thing is, it's a trolley. It's a, it's a shopping cart. But it's a trolley. The trolley, the bus, the train. A trolley is a trolley. A no, and it's, it's a trolley. It's a shop. It's a trolley. A trolley is a trolley it's, and a robot a is a car. robot. It's a car. It is a traffic light. <laughs> it's a robot. Robot. It's a robot. And a trolley is a trolley. And vibes are vibes. <laughs> I think it didn't do bad. You pretty much guessed most of the words, surprisingly. I think I made it too easy. I made it too easy. Comment down below. I think I made it too easy. What do you think? I don't know. I just know how to use context clues. Cause I, cause I gave really good clues. I basically gave the word away. I mean, when I said long and thick, shoot, I basically practically gave it away. Well, that's it for today, guys. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And I will be back with more videos. Let me know if you guys want me to do any more of South Africa versus America videos. And if so, comment down below your ideas, and I'm gonna try and make it happen for you. Peace and love, guys.